Different types of horns. Starting at the top, there's the soprano, the French horn, the mellophone, the baritone, and the contrabass bugle. This is a mellophone. It has two valves, a piston valve and a rotary. The piston is used to change the key of the horn from G to F. And the rotary valve is like a rotary on a French horn, and that's mainly used for half tones. special talent. We like everything! The drum car gave me quite a bit of a broader view of the world around me. I was able to uh, see a lot of cities and talk to a lot of people and meet a lot of different kinds of people, a lot of different ideas. It really helped round me out. Through the years, I'd like to think that my music has maintained a certain degree of creative and technical excellence. The mainstream, the stimulant that keeps my music alive and well are the young, extraordinary musicians in the band. I'm Stan Kenton, and you know, I like drum and bugle corps because it's a place where that special talent can develop. But more important, it's a unique form of musical education offering as much or more in the development of the total person than studies in English, history, and the rest. The drum and bugle corps story starts at 6 a.m. contest day. These young people are members of a national championship corps. Okay, uh, today's schedule. You've got a long bus ride. Uh, and that's the truth. About seven hours. So get a lot of rest. Uh, there's a parade this afternoon. As soon as we get there, we have to do this parade thing. After the parade, that is, we're going to work on the exit because we've got to get that together, we've got to get you off the field. The contest is at 7.30 tonight, so we'll eat after practice, uh, dress, and go to the contest right away. I think that's about it uh, for the day. You uh, older people, uh, take care of the uh, new ones, if you would, if they need any help. <laughs> if they need any help, why, be sure you give it to them. Okay, let's get on the bus. We have one advantage over most high school and college bands in that we have one show. And uh, a high school or college band may be required to do one show every week, a different show every week. So we spend all our time in polishing the one show that we have. Uh, that's really what drum corps is all about, uh, perfection. And that's exactly what we strive to do. Every minor flaw uh, in the music, in the marching, in the percussion section is worked on. We uh, get to the point, hopefully by the end of our season, which is usually in August, where we're fighting for one-tenth of a point. And we may take 15 minutes or half an hour or two hours uh, to try and get rid of one tick or one error, a tenth of a point. Uh, as far as the dedication the kids have, they have to have it, because this is what a top drum corps is all about. It's a different type of individual uh, than you find usually in, in any other type of group. It's more comparable to a football team or a basketball team, a professional group that practices hours and hours on a set play in order to win. And that's why we practice hours and hours in order to win.
Tonight at 7.30 in a stadium, we'll see a competitive sport that uses music and marching as the vehicle for competition and a football field as a stage. Earlier, I mentioned creative and technical excellence. Tonight, you will witness just that. As soon as we get to the parade, remember we want the lead sopranos to get ready and get organized. As soon as we get there, we want to work with the lead sopranos, the entire baritone and contra line. Mark is one of the new members of the Corps. Tonight will be his first competition. practicing up to 10 hours a day. Uh, the amount of practice that they have to do at home and on their own during the year is unbelievable also. Anyone can try out to join um, our drum corps or any drum corps. We've had people who've come into the horn line who have not been able to play an instrument when they tried out in October and marched the next summer with us and did very well. They do get ticked off with all the practice and all the marching. But uh, I guess they must think that it's worthwhile. creating the Polaka problem. That time it was much better because you pushed going back field. You know, the volume's fine now, the volume level. Okay, and then bump the young That was awful. Actually five. <laughs> <laughs> No, again, again, you're not concentrating. Back to the starting line. my wife and my kids there and I'll listen to this here and it's 
tearjerker. I'll sit there and I'll pretend I'll put on my sunglasses and bring out my handkerchief and pretend I have to blow my nose in it. I just love it. It's really fantastic. And I know if people would get out that they would love this sort of thing. system is divided between giving credit for excellence in performance while at the same time subtracting points for flaws and mistakes. A perfect score is 100 points and the winning core achieves this high score by having an outstanding program and performing it with the fewest mistakes. There are a total of nine judges, six on the field and three sitting high in the stadium. Three of the field judges record errors in bugling, percussion, and marching, deducting one-tenth of a point for each error. Two of the judges are evaluating the content of the corps' performance, and they give credit points. The sixth field judge checks timing and marks all sorts of penalties. The three remaining are the general effect judges. on releases, any question on attacks? From California, ladies and gentlemen, the Santa Clara Vanguard. Judges and timers ready. Car ready. Santa Clara, you may enter the field of competition.
Vanguard. The Vanguard Drum Corps, under the direction of Mr. Gail Royer, was formed in 1967. They have won over 90% of the contests they have entered, including the VFW national title. I was pretty nervous because I made a couple mistakes. <laughs> Think you're gonna win? Oh, so I guess we'll have to wait and see how the other cars do. win while we're doing it yeah I'm happy if we lose I'm unhappy but I'm not gonna beat my head against the wall when there's scores the drum majors okay I'll do that we're that's when you bring them front and center right front center Scores announced. Your position. Take one step forward. Salute after the scores announced, and stay there. Okay. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've been waiting for. Here are the scores. In fifth place, with the score of 71.15, the Anaheim Kingsmen. With the score of 72.45, the Kilties. In third place, with a score of 75.85. If you win, you win together. If you lose, you lose together. The Troopers. And in second place, with a score of 
It's a unique form of musical education offering as much or more in the development of the total person.